Hi, I'm Yasmari Calazzo, and I'm a junior at Cooperative Arts High School. This painting, The Death of Lucretia by Gavin Hamilton, has a timeline. It may not be in numbers, but in symbols. Starting from the left side of the painting to the right side. The scabbard. It's on the bottom left corner of the painting in a puddle of blood. That blood leads to the bottom of Lucretia's right breast. Lucretia has just committed suicide after being raped by Sextus Tarquinius, son of the last Roman king, Lucius Tarquinius Superbus, and is trusting in Brutus, Calatinus, her husband, and Spurius Lucretius, her father, to change Rome and become the Roman Republic. All of that can be determined by her gripping on Brutus's cloak. Brutus is holding the dagger with blood on it, while Spurius Lucretius is holding Brutus's arm, showing agreement and togetherness. Spurius Lucretius is also pointing at the dagger and looking up asking higher power for help. They are also making an oath to overrule the Roman monarchy and form a Roman Republic. Lucretius' death was an act of pride and the beginning of a revolution.